Hello, living in Boulder Vlog. It's 3:59 a.m. Um, I'm actually very fresh. This is the this is my me in the morning, like pretty much just getting up. Uh, I've been up, I don't know, like a half hour or an hour or something like that so far. Can't remember exactly. Um, uh, <clears throat> yeah, because I got myself diurnalized. Um, Normally, if I do a video at 4 o'clock in the morning, it's because I'm about to go to sleep. Because I've been working all the time, but yeah, now it's because I'm getting up. Pretty cool. Um, so I did a video. I'm pretty high right now, but I'm not tired. I did a video um, a couple days ago. I um, can't remember. Yeah, I think I had segued into a bi-weekly history test page for a day, and then I went back to... Uh, Coliseum, and I'll get going on that bi-weekly history test, whatever, whenever I feel like it. <laughs> Next time I Google Earth crashes or something, but I think I did a pretty good job of laying the groundwork. Um, so, uh, yeah, I'm doing the, the stairs of the Coliseum, and uh, I got, you know, I finished all the flights of stairs to the top. I had to guess what the ones to the very top looked like because I, there wasn't a single illustration or description. Um, but you know that people went up there. Somebody mentioned that could, the roof of the Coliseum could hold 5,000 people. So I just built some, um, I just built like a stair structure that goes like that. Like I think eight steps, eight steps. So, uh, to the roof, and there were like six of them, and, um, and then, uh, the stairs, there was a little bit of decision making I had to do about the stairs to the, uh, the top level. No, I mean the stairs to the, um, what would that be, the third level, uh, the, the final stands before the, uh, the columns on the top. Um... The stairs go like that, but I don't think, I think there were other stairs that went off the other way to take you to the, uh, the colonnade on the third level. It split off because you can see the holes on Google Earth, but then you see the diagrams going the other way. So anyways, when I was done, uh, I just, right now I'm adding the other branch of stairs that take you into the colonnade. And I just finished my first, so then I'll get going on the other ones. And then I'll be done uh, with all of the stairs, and I can start working on the uh, levels around the stairs. And it's that's, and then after that, it's the stands, and I guess I'm done. Um, but um, I, uh, I think I predicted I could be done by with it by Sunday, but that was before I took a day off to do the biweekly history test page. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, I don't even that far away from finishing. Um, but yeah, it's going to be interesting to see if I can actually take a tour inside of the Coliseum and have it work and stuff. I think I can. Um, and, uh, and then maybe do a YouTube video for about it. But knowing me, I might not do that right away. I'll probably just finish the Coliseum and then not want to do a YouTube video about it because it'll take too long. And then just try to finish all the other Colosseums and the uh, Circus Maximus. Um, yeah, not take as much time, but I don't know. Maybe I could make them with detail really quickly, you know, because Colosseum was particularly complicated. Um, yeah, and I, I went detailed with it. I don't have to go as detailed with the other ones, but um, and then and then uh, try to finish Rome. Um, yeah, if I can finish Rome in a couple of weeks, a couple of months, that'd be cool. Um, so, uh, got my doctor's appointment on Monday, get this biopsy hopefully. I know that this is cancer. Um, and uh, what else, what else? I was listening, I've been listening to, uh, I've been doing the bi-weekly history thing. It's really fun, the, or my bi-weekly history test page, studying the, uh, uh, the decades from, 2000, from zero to 2000 on my page. Um, <clears throat> I have the chart, <clears throat> but I have them linked. So I click the random number generator, that number on my chart, I click on it. 
highlight it, it reads it to me, that's like 10 minutes. And that's a fun way to learn history because um, you kind of piece it together like a um, like, uh, um, puzzle. Uh, you know, some of them you know better than others and it, it really motivates you to try to learn a little bit. So yeah, I mean, maybe I'll, I'll listen to this for like a month and then I'll have the courage or whatever. The, uh, I'll be able to set the time aside to do the uh, bi-weekly history test, participate in the first version of it. Um, but as soon as I'm done with the Coliseum in a couple of days, I'll uh, make sure that there's a, uh, a link that people can download it and check it out if anybody wants to. Um, it's probably more fun if I just do a YouTube video doing a tour of it with what I have first. People probably prefer that, but uh, yeah, try to do that one of these things. Anyways, I'm going to get back to work now, later.